Welcome back, everyone. You may be in a situation where you're trying to go ahead and turn on the keyboard light for your Windows or Mac PC. Now, to do this, it's actually very, very easy. What you want to do is you can either turn it on via the settings of your specific PC, or you can actually go ahead and turn it on via your keyboard that you have for your PC. Now, not every single keyboard that you will own will have some sort of button layout like this, and not every single keyboard you own will actually have some sort of keyboard backlight. So do keep that in mind. The quickest way to go ahead and toggle this or even see if your keyboard supports it is to see the packaging of your box and see if there was ever a backlit keyboard light enabled. Now to do this, what you wanna do is you wanna look inside of your function keys of your specific keyboard. So you can go ahead and scroll down. What you wanna do here is you wanna go ahead and see right next to the escape key if there were if there was a brightness toggle there. Now, theoretically, there should be brightness toggles there where you can go and toggle on your actual, you know, laptop screen on and off, but there should be a little keyboard button as well. There should be a little keyboard button which will basically allow you to adjust the brightness level of your specific keyboard. Now, on some keyboards, if you click the function key and you click on, you know, the key and you click on the, you know, brightness toggles, you should actually be able to go ahead and adjust the keyboard backlight at that point. You may want to check specifically, some people mentioned the F4 or F5 buttons on your PC in order to check if the, you know, brightness keyboard toggles are there. That's another thing you can do. Now, on top of that, what you can do, sometimes you can make your way over to your settings of your keyboard. You can make your way over to your settings of your Windows PC on Windows 11, and you might be able to see a keyboard brightness toggle within the settings panel. Again, not a guarantee, but it's another thing you can do to go ahead and pretty much get one step closer into fixing this for the most part. So those are the main ways to go ahead and do it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.